Today in our 2014 Heartland Bighorn, we're going to be installing Dexter's Trailer Breakaway Kit with built-in battery charger, part number 34-285. We've got our breakaway and battery kit mounted on our fifth wheel. This is going to apply the brakes on your Bighorn in the event of a disconnect. You can see here our wheel turns freely, but if I pull the breakaway pin, our brakes apply and our wheels lock up, bringing our trailer to a safe stop. We'll begin our installation by mounting the larger components. We're gonna mount our breakaway switch here on our fifth wheel connection point towards the front. And we just mounted this using a self-tapping screw. The screw didn't come included with the kit, but you can pick one up at your local hardware store. Next, we move to our front compartment where we mounted our battery in its battery box. We mounted it as close to our brake actuator as possible, and we used some self-tapping screws to get that mounted. Next, we routed our wires from our breakaway switch up to our junction box behind our fifth wheel, where we connected the orange and black wire to our battery positive wire, or our charge line wire, and we connected the blue wire to a black wire that we had to run over to our brake actuator. To get that black wire routed that connects to our brake actuator, we used one of the existing wires as a pole wire, because that wire has to go from here across into our side compartment here. Here in our propane compartment on the passenger side, you can see the red wire in this loom here. This is the wire I used as the pull wire. I disconnected it from our battery and pulled it up towards our fifth wheel up there, made our black wire connection to that with some electrical tape, and just pulled it back through to this point here. And you can see our black wire here. I bundled it all together in the existing loom and continued routing it towards our brake actuator. This is the cold side of your breakaway switch. You want this to connect to your braking system so it'll activate the brakes in the event that the breakaway pin gets pulled. For our electric over hydraulic setup, we connected it to the yellow wire, which is the breakaway switch wire. If you just had regular electric brakes, you would connect this to the power side of your electric brakes. And on our battery, we connected the white wire to ground and the black wire to the battery that already exists on the other side of this panel over there. If you don't have an existing battery on your motor home, you would connect the black wire to the charge line from your seven pole connector, and you would connect the orange and black wire, instead of connecting it to the charge line on your seven pole, you would connect it to this orange line here. But since we already had an existing battery, this would just connect in conjunction with it. And that completes our installation of Dexter's Trailer Breakaway Kit with built-in battery charger on our 2014 Heartland Bighorn.